Musicians Corner on Timeless and Irish with Billy Donegan. Today we join you from the Gap of Dunlow, uh, this beautiful scenic part of the kingdom, and I am joined by the singing Jarvi himself, Jer Healy. Uh, Jer, uh, you're welcome to Musicians Corner. Thank you very much, Billy. So, what came first, the Jarving or the singing? Well, the singing came first, Billy. Um, at the age of seven, uh, I learned to play the button key accordion uh, from the great Nicholas McAuliffe in Castle Island. Uh, that was my first start off. Where did you take it from there then? I took it from there then. I, I went on to secondary school then and learned another bit there and uh, left school in 1986. And uh, mum and dad bought a beautiful piano accordion for me in 1984. And I learned that then from the, from the squeeze box and went on to start playing music then in 1986. And to there I have remained since. And uh, you operate as a one-man band? I'm a one-man show now, yeah. And uh, how, how, that was going very well for you, obviously, before? Yeah, we had some fantastic years there until Mr. Colbert came along and silenced us for a while, but that would only be for a while, we hope. And uh, how much of the, of the county or the co country did you cover? Yeah, we, we covered most of Munster, you know. Fantastic people we've met along the way and would like to thank them for all the good years we had with them. And, Hopefully they'll all be back dancing against us in the not so distant future. And when did you take up the jarving? I'm jarving since I was 10 years old. Uh, I started behind my father on, a, on an old beer crate, standing up, following him with another horse and carriage. And uh, you, you enjoy doing it? I love it. I love meeting people. I love talking to people and finding out where they're from and learning all about their countries, which is wonderful, you know. How has the, the COVID thing affected the jarving now? Well, COVID really didn't affect the Jarvie Institute because it was all outdoors, you know. And uh, I don't think COVID lived here in this valley. And at the moment, are you back to, to, to uh, some sort of normality? There's a nice bit of normality after coming back down the last five or six weeks, you know, since restrictions have eased and stuff. And people are starting to find themselves again, you know, and get, get going and hopefully do what they can do and take their families on holidays. As, as we say, it is all staycations this year and no better people than the Irish people to come to Killarney and look after you. The musical career then, uh, when did you start recording? I started recording five years ago. Five years ago was my first recording. And that was? A, a song called What If I Walked Away. And uh, where did you pick that up? I picked up that, that was a song that T.R. Dallas had, had formerly wrote and, and recorded as well. And it went very well for me. <laughs> We met at the dance in Bundoran That was a few months ago You were there with your friends Over to you I did go We danced and then we got talking I felt myself falling for you Now we're in love with each other I am so happy with you Oh, but what if you said you were leaving? What if you walked away? My heart would be lonely forever If you I won with me each day It was fate that brought us together As I wasn't going out on that night I was feeling a little bit lazy But something didn't change my mind You were there for the weekend Having a break from your home If I didn't go dancing on that night It's you I would never have known oh, But what if you said you were leaving what if you walked away? My heart would be lonely forever If you I won with me each day Now every day I keep thinking How lucky in life I have been to meet with someone so special 
You're the sweetest that I've ever seen I'm over the moon that I met you Cause you light up this world for me That's why I want to be with you Till the Lord calls time up on me Oh, but what if you said you were leaving? What if you walked away? My heart would be lonely forever It's you I want with me each day Oh, but what if you said you were leaving? What if you walked away? My heart would be lonely forever it's you I want with me each day Yes, my heart would be lonely forever It's you I want with me each day you, You've also started doing a bit of writing songs. I wrote a couple of songs, uh, Billy. I wrote a song especially for um, a very, very good friend that I lost in Castle Island three years ago, Maureen Sheehan. I wrote The Darling Queen for her. And uh, just three months ago then, I wrote my new song, The Love of a Dear Irish Mother. Um, that's dedicated to my own mum that I lost in 1992. And uh, <clears throat> as you'll see on the video, everything is very, very true to life on it. Where I started out from, in Riverlow House, and uh, back to Riverlow House again at the end of the video. There's an old armchair in the corner Although it's been vacant for years For the spot that was held by sweet mother And a lady that I hold so dear It was there that she raised me and me Through all my tender years I can never forget this sweet lady and a mother so full of good cheer So let's sing it once more for all mothers Living and then gone before Remember all that she taught us And we hold in our hearts evermore The years they roll on for a mother As she watches her children grow tall at the wink of an eye, the time passes by From the biggest one down to the small But the love of a mother stays with us No matter wherever we roam And we'll always thank the dear lady For making our house a sweet home Sing it once more for all mothers Living and then gone before Remember all that she taught us And we hold in our hearts evermore Mother has passed and now long gone But the memories they still are here all the love and affection she gave us With a bright smile and never fear And as our children grow older And they climb all around in our knees I'll teach them all that she taught us And hold them the way she held me So let's again once more for all mothers Living and then gone before Remember all that she taught us And we hold in our hearts evermore Remember all that she taught us And we hold in our hearts evermore There's no playing at the moment, unfortunately. How have you been keeping yourself 
while you're not playing or do you still play away a bit? You know, I do small bit at home, Billy. Uh, we do small bit at home there. We have a few old sessions around the, around the table ourselves at home. And uh, I have a bit of a farm as well. And we keep that going. And um, that keeps the show ticking over for us, you know. I was longing for it to come back to the Jarving. And uh, delighted that it's back now in full swing. And hopefully we'll get until next October out of that. And it's a big change, of course, from being used to going out playing every night. Tis, tis, like, going, tis like going from rags to riches, uh, Billy. Tis a, tis a totally different way of life, you know. And um, it's hard, very, very hard to get used to it was at the start. But uh, now that we're a year and a quarter into it, uh, it's not as hard anymore. But we're still longing, we're still longing to get back on that stage and get back to our friends and our comrades that we met along the way and hopefully that all will be well when we will get back and meet them. No, is there anyone like to say thanks to or say hello to today? Well, first and foremost, uh, Billy, uh, I'd like to thank yourself for coming out here and, and taking me and give me, giving me the opportunity to, to speak. Uh, number two, I'd like to thank Leo Fitzgerald and his dad for all the beautiful scenery and background they have put in this video for me. Uh, I'd like to thank all the people of the county that supported me all over the years and far and beyond. And last but not least, I'd like to thank my own wife and family for always supporting me with the last 35 years on the music scene. And uh, I was glad that everything went very, very well for us. And hopefully that will go well in, in the not so distant future again. George, thank you very much. Billy, you're very welcome. And once again, you're very welcome to the Gafford and Law and call again. Thank you. Musicians' Corner on Timeless and Irish with Billy Donegan.